Tally Martino. Mom, Tim Martino. And Leon Crazy. What makes Crazy News unique is the staff. The staff, um, it's just really cool to see people that work here, if they're going for a college degree or whatever the places in my life they move on, you know, after they get their degree, or they come back to visit us and tell us their story, you know, it's kind of cool that we're able to study this stuff and their life's path. Yeah, we try to be um, like a fun, lighthearted, family friendly place that welcomes all kinds of people and everyone who is welcome here. And the world is such a crazy place, especially now. It's nice that people can come here. And Enjoy our food and drink and their company and just kind of like forget about um, crazy food. Our coffee and our, our specialty latte that makes our, our different and our egg burritos. I love the Hercules, it's my favorite lunch sandwich. It's right in front of the Pancake Case Theater. It's just everything you need in breakfast and more. Get your day started, hang on the cure, just everything you need to get through your day. Pancakes, cheese, sauce, and bacon, and some ramen for zero. It's going to dunk a room. Growing up, uh, I had a bunch of great cooks in my family. Everyone always kind of said, don't get into the culinary world, it's a tough world. And that was just my passion for cooking, finding the recipes, and finding the recipes. Things about food and making people happy when they eat it. To me, we're eclectic. We try to have um, something for everyone. We try to be a lighthearted, old school establishment. Yeah, I think when you walk through the doors, crazy, you just want to feel like you're home, and that we welcome all kinds of kinds. I'm just too crazy. I'm crazy. It's a slogan. I love interacting with customers, um, spending time with staff. I love just oh, no. serving people, and when people say that they love this place, they love this place, the best feeling in the entire world. You know, we really try and work hard. Make people feel comfortable here and have them have a good time. And our staff works really hard. It's really special being able to go and eat. And we created a place that people like. I think the part about being the owner is uh, our kitchen staff, hiring the kitchen staff. Our kitchen staff has been with us for a long time and just getting from all their personalities and what they bring to the table, recipe wise, food idea wise. Um, we've had one of our employees work for us, he was just starting with a rugby player and he never worked in the kitchen in his life. And one shop fresh that worked for his booth for four years. And uh, that's just something we hope to see. I grew up down the street um, and I've always loved the holidays here. It really sort of makes it so special for, for visitors and for locals. Um, scarecrows, the, the Christmas tree lighting, all the Christmas tree decorations. They you know, try to really get the community. Uh, involved or not only her organization, Maria Rafio really did a great job of preserving the history of the village center and it, it really is a beautiful place and we're really lucky to be, to be a part of it. Yeah, my would be, I think it was the spring appreciation day. Um, I was working in the kitchen and look outside, we're packed, there's a bunch of people all over the room and I just see this petting zoo outside. I was like, I gotta hop out of the kitchen. I walked out of the kitchen and I just looked around at how awesome this place was. Um, and everyone just had a good time. So then I talked to the owner of the Petting Zoo, and we wound up finding the document that our engagement party. And since she's like, probably three times a day. <laughs> That's my favorite, I think. It's funny. Our staff works really hard. Our kitchen staff works really hard. They work really hard. And anybody that works in a restaurant knows that it's a lot of hours, you know, hard mentally and physically, especially after the just be nice to your servers and be patient with the restaurants that you, you patronize. It's a challenge, but we're grateful that we have the staff that we have and that so many people support us to get through this pandemic. And we're still going strong. Still crazy. Still crazy. Still crazy.